innovative, amazing science with Sanana. I believe and I hope that you are doing great. So am I. And it is always a pleasure to see everyone out there. Let me take you all back again to my childhood memories. It so happened that as a child, me and my brother just enjoyed and loved to drink milk. It was not only the plain milk, but we added something or the other to the milk and we used to just enjoy drinking it. Sometimes we added some chocolate chips, sometimes some syrup or sometimes some wafers. But we made sure that we are going to add something and we are going to enjoy it. One day, my cousin's sister came to visit us and she wanted a drink and she made the drink by herself. She took some warm water and she added some honey and lemon and she started drinking it. I was wondering what is this drink all about and she said that it is a very good and healthy drink. I was like thinking how does it taste because I never had that earlier. But I didn't say her anything then she left for the day and me and my brother thought to make the same drink again. To our surprise there was no lemon at home. So we thought okay let us just take a glass of milk add some honey and whatever like things are available at home we are going to make it but make sure that we are going to add some honey and we started we took a glass of milk we added some honey and we kept on adding something or the other things which were available at home after some time i just noticed a difference in that glass of milk which I had never seen earlier. It was something different. I asked my brother, what is the reason and why there is difference in the layers? Even he did not understand. So we called our parents and my mama came and she started explaining me that what is the reason and why this difference in layers I could observe. So she started explaining the signs and she even like explain that there are some things if you keep adding to that it is going to penetrate inside or it is going to sink inside but there are some things which is not going to penetrate nor sink it is going to float much of science i did not understand at that age but later as i grew up i understood it completely that what exactly was the reason of that experience and later I and my brother enjoyed thoroughly. So today I am here again to share the same activity which I had tried when I was very small. So to observe what is happening to the different layers stay tuned with me and let's get started. So the things required are an empty glass. Here I've taken some honey. This is plain water. And here I've taken cooking oil. And this is syringe vial. An empty cap. Coin. And this is sponge. So what I'm going to do is, I'll take this honey and I'm going to pour it inside this glass. Next, I'll take the water. So if you find difficult to pour the water, you just use this syringe. Okay, that's a little funny, but then it's good so that you can pour it at the sides. Be careful. It's lovely. Okay. Okay. 
okay so i have taken the honey and the water and my last step is i'm going to add the oil so if you want you can use the same syringe for that or you can just take this glass and pour it i'll just use the syringe okay it's lovely This last one if you want you can just take this glass tilt a bit and just pour it okay I'm done with this part so now if you observe this the layers are different okay the down one we have the honey middle one is the water and the top layer is the oil can you see why these layers are not mixing why they are separate it's just because of the density and all the three things are different in their densities if you see the honey it is the most denser as compared to these two so it has settled down then comes the water it is less dense than the honey so it is here and if you see the last one which is the cooking oil it is the least in terms of density so it is at the top layer so now this glass looks beautiful so what we are going to do next is we are going to put all these things inside and let us observe what is happening okay so this coin i'm going to put it inside here i go can you see I'm going to put this coin inside okay can you see we cannot see the coin because it has crossed the oil layer then it has crossed the water layer and now it is down deep in the honey layer it is inside it went inside because it is dense so it went inside so now I'm going to take this cap I'll just put it inside let's see we'll just press it a little bit okay 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 now if you observe carefully if you see the cap it has crossed the oil layer and it has settled on top of the water surface that means it is lighter as compared to the water so it is not going inside the water but it has just settled on the surface then we are having this sponge we are going to put the sponge right here i go i'll just okay see if you look at the sponge it has just settled on top of the oil surface and it is not going down that means it is the lightest if you compare with the cap as well as the coin if you enjoyed this activity do like it and do not forget to subscribe by pressing the bell icon which is right there on your screen. And if you wish to share your experience with everyone, do put it in the comment section or do write a mail so that in my future upcoming videos, I can share your experience through an experiment with everyone. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.